going to be a different kind of day. Today, guys, we are just chilling like a villain. Whoa, chilling like a villain. Haley, where does that come from? Descendants. Yeah, guys, so right now we are just basically chilling. I am bringing my little crumb snatcher right there, Haley Marie, to school, and I'm sitting out front sitting out in front of her school I'm about to get ready to go do some dumpster diving <laughs> if you are not familiar with my dumpster diving channel make sure you look down in the comment section because that's the link to the dumpster diving channel okay you guys um, also today I will be probably going to a few thrift stores um, I'm hoping that I can find some clothes in my size not church clothes but some regular everyday clothes right now in the winter time this is like one of my favorite outfits you can see i got bleach stains and everything on it but i want to start getting in the habit of dressing up when i leave the doors you know and not just for church but for everyday running errands you know chicago booth is the school that my husband graduated from where he got his mba from so i'm always rocking the uh school attire you know what I'm saying? It's so funny because I found this particular suit dumpster diving. Somebody else went to Chicago booth and they threw out their college gear. I was super hyped when I found it because this is the school that my husband went to. And when I showed him this outfit, he was excited too. Like, yes. Now, in the past, he did buy me several Chicago booth outfits when he was in the school, which I still have. But to find the entire jumpsuit was awesome check out Haley's hair I don't know if you can see it look at that her stylist did a really really great job I absolutely love this style on my baby we got it now where her braids are now much longer than they were before we got 40 inches this time and guys guess what we hit a sale on the hair the hair is usually $5.99 a pack, but this time we got three packs for $8. So you know I racked up. Now we are set for the next, what, four hairstyles. Oh my gosh, look at this, you guys. My son will love this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my goodness. He is going to love this. You got the little cards, the cash register, the little drinks. Look at that. Oh my goodness. All right, cool. All right, you guys. So I just took these toys that I found and I will have them in bleach water, bleach all over my hands. But so much. Bleach. Also, and this is like piping hot water. Like your food truck? What do you like? What would I like? Well, let me take a taco and the burger. Okay. And what else? Huh? The taco is here. We don't have the actual bread. We probably left it there. Can, can have taco. Yeah, this is this the taco right here. We just need I, I'm gonna see if I can find you the bread let, online. Let, let me cook it. You wanna cook it? You cook it right here on the grill. Whoa, look at you cooking. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I found my baby this food truck. Look at that, you see the little wheels? Oh my goodness. What's in there? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna look online and see if I can find the rest of the food truck accessories. Plate. Uh-oh, that's okay. I don't need the plate. Keep the pizza right there. Keep it right, let me see. Let me try it. Mmm, thank you. Huh? You, you, you want burger? Yeah, can I try some burger, please? You, I love me bacon. You want to cook it? Okay, thank you. It's ready. It's ready. Whoa, look at that yummy Sorry. burger. You see the turkey bacon. You see the lettuce. 
and the meat patty. It's right here. Yeah, that goes there. You can't. Just put it down in the in the sink. No. That's the sink right there. Put it in the sink. Very good. All right, I'm gonna try my burger. Mmm. Do you, you, you want pizza? Mmm. Do you, you, you want pizza? Do I want pizza? Yes. Let me try some pizza. Oh wow. Wait. Let me make it. Okay, go ahead and make it. Whoa. Da 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 Number four, I don't know. Number two, broccoli. You, you, Whoa. You, you, you want juice? Oh, uh, yeah, I'll take some juice. Whoa, that looks very good. Okay. Look at that. Money. Money. Oh, shoot. I need money? I don't have money. It's coin. A coin? Okay, here, let me give you a pretend coin. Here you go. Thank you. Blinky. That's five cents. Okay, I can add up. You gonna ring it up? Thank you. I'll take a large banana smoothie. There you go. Oh, that was delicious. You, you, you want grape? Uh, yeah. I'll go ahead and take the grape. Wow. Whoa! Look at that, you guys. That's the grape smoothie. And look, it's purple with a white top. Whoa! That's the small one. So we have the small, the medium, and large. And listen, guess what? They all make different sounds. You, you, you want a cookie? Yes, I'll have a cookie. Wait, let me make it. You want to bake the cookie? <laughs> oh my goodness, guys, this is so cute. Hi, Samuel. Okay, so... it's ready. It's ready. Whoa, look at that chocolate chip cookie. All right, there you go. Let's put it right there. Thank you, son. Okay, I'll take this strawberry. Oh, wow. Here, let them taste it. You want to taste it, you guys? Go ahead and taste it. Okay. All right. Bye. 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 All right, y'all. Let's go ahead and go inside the thrift store. Let's see what we can find. I got to make a quick, quick run in here because I'm on my way to a birthday party. I was supposed to be stopping at Sam's Club to pick up some flowers uh, for a friend of mine. Hold on. I'm going to a friend of mine's birthday party. Hopefully I can find maybe two, three pieces. I can't stay in here long because I want to go to Sam's Club to pick up some uh, flowers because this is my first time going over her house and I don't like to go over people's houses, you know, for the first time empty handed. So I was taught, believe it or not, by my husband's cousin um to bring flowers to people's homes especially when you go for the first time and then not only that it's her birthday so you know giving her a bouquet of flowers for her birthday is also a great gesture but let me show you guys what i'm wearing look so check out the shoes you guys i took it way back with the penny loafers i actually put pennies that i found dumpster diving in my shoe check out the penny loafers and then my nails i did myself using the no chip kit that I found dumpster diving. I'm gonna learn how to save money as far as self care, but we are going inside. Let's go ahead and go inside the thrift store. Excuse me. Yeah, it's a little bit that we get the That's kind of cute. Bet you it's not cotton. This is real cute. Look at that, y'all. <laughs> I actually like that little cheesy looking sweater. Let me see the material. Yeah, I want to start getting natural blends. Cotton wool. Oh, this is from Shein, too. This is my size. I think I'm going to put that on there. Oh, let me look at the material. That's what I was looking at, not the brand. Acrylic. Ugh. But that's so cute. I might put this on my on my wrist. Look, I got all this Shein stuff in here. That's ugly. Because this thrift store, they don't really have a whole lot of like good quality clothes to have some you know cheap looking stuff these are cute i like these what's the price 5.99 
Look at that. You guys know I love me some earth tone colors, right? I'm gonna have to put that on my, on my, on my, uh, on my list to get. Let me see. Just want to get a lot of nice, cute pieces. A lot of nice, cute pieces, you know? Look at this, you guys. It's cute. This is cute. These are nice for Sammy. Clean those off and he'll be good to go. They don't have a price. I gotta go find out how much they cost. Oh, I'm not seeing a lot of here today. Uh, I think I like this. $5.99. I think I'm gonna get that. It's just fun. I think it's, you know, that's a fun little shirt. But will I wear it? Probably not. I'll just be getting it just for the heck of it. I will not wear this. There's another shirt that I saw that I thought was okay. It'll be sitting really sitting in my closet, so I'm not going to get that. And then I saw these trousers here. I really do like that cuff right there. I got to try these on. I'm just hoping that I can fit these. And if they are, then I'll get them. And they want $5.99. So I'm going to walk up out of here with these and this and possibly these shoes here. You have these. Oh, I'm sorry. You have these. The lily isn't quite open yet. You have these. Mm. That's a big, beautiful bunch, too. All right, guys. So we are here at the party. I got the flowers, I got here. And then I got Sammy little shoes right there. I didn't get the pants because they just didn't, they didn't fit right. My thighs was too big. So I said, man, I'll just try to find some cute Zara pants somewhere else, or I possibly will go to another thrift store. But let me go ahead and go into this party, you guys. I'm not gonna record out of respect for my friend and her space, you know? All right, so I'll bring y'all back up later. Hey, 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 y'all. So today is the next day. And um, I had a really great time yesterday over my friend's house, being able to uh, fellowship and enjoy my, uh, my friend's birthday. It was really, really fantastic. Now, the people that I was with, they were a little older, but even still, they had a ball. And just, you know, laughing and singing happy birthday, eating cake, you guys. It was so much fun oh my gosh some people have a misconception that older people don't know how to have fun but i beg to differ the people that i was with yesterday are definitely vibrant they are spunky they are uh, just enjoying life in each other's company i enjoy myself to the max they were dancing they were laughing you know so I was inspired. I was truly, truly inspired, giving me something to look forward to when I reached my 60s and 70s. It was, it was so, so much fun. And sometimes I just need that moment when I could just let my hair down and not have to worry about, um, you know, children or anything like that. The kids were here with Antoine and he, you know, just gave me the day to just enjoy myself and I definitely took advantage of that okay I want to say just happy birthday to my sister in Christ if you are watching you know who you are thank you so much for the invite I had a great time hanging out with you your friends and your husband and I appreciate you inviting me into your home say hi good morning all right right so right now you guys Samuel is helping me put the flowers in the pot Right? Are you helping me put the flowers in the pot? Yeah. Yeah, he wanna show you guys the pot. So that's what we're gonna be doing right now. We're gonna 
put flowers in the pot. You guys know I love flowers. Flowers is my jam right now. It's what brings me inner it peace. Um, I love the smell of flowers. I just love having flowers around my house, especially Happy when my birthday. house is clean. Um, and so I'm just starting to get him involved in a lot of my things that I do in the kitchen this? so he can my, my grow this, up. My this cornbread. Yes, that's cornbread. So he can get in the habit of doing certain things. So when he's an adult, he can be a well-rounded man for his wife, right? And um, so right now I have my cup, my my flower vase here that I found dumpster diving. And I even have my flowers here. And then these are the flowers right there as well. I have some carnations. I come to realize, guys, that carnations are the best. They um, last a very long time. We tried, me and my husband, we did a challenge. Yes. Let's do the game. Okay. My husband and I, we did a challenge. We wanted to see whether or not roses lasted longer than carnations, guys. And we came to find out that roses only last a good week. Carnations, they can last up to three weeks if you take very good care of them. What we also do for our plants, uh -huh. uh, for our flowers, we use uh -huh. sugar and we use a little bit of vinegar to keep the mold from growing in the pot. And we use sugar as plant food in combination with the plant food like this that comes with the flowers right here. And it definitely make the, uh, makes the flowers last a very, very long time. So again, I have my big boy right here. Say hi. I have my big boy right here helping me out. So I'm going to put the camera right here. Okay. And then I have the big boy helping me. Okay. So I have my cutting... Uh, shears here mm -hmm. and then I like to take my flowers and I like to cut them on an angle hold on Sam move your fingers okay. see I like to cut them like that on the angle I really don't know the real reason why people cut it on the angle I just like to do it because I think it just looks better in the pot all right and so then I allow him to put the flower in the vase see very good okay go ahead put it in the vase uh, pink isn't my favorite color. I like pink, but it's not my favorite color. My favorite color is uh, orange. I like the earth tone colors. Here you go, son. I like neutral colors. I like orange. Here you go. I like... Smell it. Mmm. I think they said it smells good. I like to. My favorite colors are orange, yellow, cream. Let's go I really don't think he's listening to me about my favorite color. All right, there you go, son. You're welcome. Hey, go smell it. Hey, go smell it. Mmm, put it right here. Put it right there so they can smell it right there. Wait, wait, let's hold it back. Mmm. Okay, put it in the pot. In the pot. Yep. Let's do it again. Okay, we're gonna do it again. You are such a big helper. You know that? Here you go, sweetheart. You are such a big helper. Thank you, Samuel. Uh oh. Wait, let's see. Hey, go. Smell it. Hey, go. Smell it. Okay. Go ahead and put it in the pot, buddy. I smell them. Pot, vase, face, pot, tomato, tomato. Smell. Tomato. Push it. No, you got to stick it in there like this. Look at mama. Uh -huh. Stick it all the way. You see the water? You have to stick it in the water like this. Okay, let's Okay, go. Try. See? Very good. Very good. Uh-oh, now. Good job. Get down. Give me kisses. Mwah. Thank you. You were such a big helper. Mm, I love you. This cornbread. Yep, that's cornbread. So he is pointing to the cornbread box here. We are going to have beans with smoked turkey tails and vegetarian cornbread. We get vegetarian I cornbread because it doesn't have lard in it. Because I our household is a household know. that doesn't eat pork, we have to find know. alternatives. Um, and this is really, really good. You can't even tell the juice. difference between this one and the other. I want juice. Okay, get down for a minute. I'll give you some juice and I'm done. Okay. I love you. Good job. Thank you, help. We're giving five. There. Okay, I'll give you some juice in a minute. All right, guys, so here it is. This is our bouquet of carnations that I am really really feeling right now um yeah so if you know a flower that lasts very like a really long time that lasts longer than if possible two weeks 
please leave it down in the comment section, okay? Now, I absolutely love my no chip polish, but the only thing about it is trying to get this stuff off of my nails. It's the worst. Now, I bought some acetone, and then I have these cotton balls to try to acetone it off, but I really don't feel like doing all of that. That's a process within itself. I usually just take the drill, drill it off, and I'm good to go. I was absolutely loving this red. I remember when I was a kid, my mother did not allow us to, re to wear anything red. No red nail polish, no red underwear, nothing red because she said it was for adults. But I love red. I think it's cute. I think I'm going to go ahead and do red again on my nails. Probably a little bit later on in the day. So now that Samuel is gone, I can take this time to just play dress up. I usually like to take the clothes that I buy. I like to pair them with certain tops and accessories, and shoes, you know, just to see how it'll look. So this is the skirt that I bought right here, you guys. Boom, bam, 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 bam. I love this skirt. Oh, my goodness. I love this skirt. And it's by Leslie. You can tell it's an old brand because the tag is pretty vintage, right? But yeah, so I got this, right? Now I can dress this up and I can dress this down. Now let me show you guys what I thought about putting this with. So I have this shirt here let me take it right here, that I got from Old Navy. I didn't get this from Old Navy. I found this dumpster diving. When I found this, you guys, it was wet. It was soggy. And it just was looking like a wet cat. But I took it to the cleaners. And as you can see, it looks as if I bought it from the store. It came from Old Navy. I actually found this sweater, guys. Dumpster diving. Yeah, buddy. So, again, I think that looks good. What do you think? I don't know if you guys can see it. Um, slide these clothes over a little bit so you can really get a good look. I'm going to put it like right there. There we go. See? I have it something like that. I don't know if you guys can see. All right, I hate that I had to put it on the floor, but having it on my rack, it just wasn't behaving. All right, so this is it. This is so you can get an idea as to how it'll look. So you see I have the shoes there, the boots, nice cute cognac boots with the burgundy skirt and the cream color sweater. I think that's cute. Um, Here's the hat right here. Uh, boop. Right there. So that's how it'll look together. Again, I just don't feel like trying this on, you guys. I'm just in my PJs and I don't feel like taking off anything and having to do my hair and all that. So hopefully you can get a, a idea right here. What do you think? Do you like it like this or do you like it like this? I have the black combat boots with the black leather bomber jacket. Guess what? Yes, I found the jacket dumpster diving <laughs> and I kept the nice cream furry sweater that I got dumpster diving that came from Old Navy. So what do you think? Do you like this look better or do you like the other look better? Now I can even go down a little bit more, dress it down a little bit further this way. Now, what are your thoughts? Do you like it this way? This is really, really dressed down. You can quickly throw something like this on, head to the store and bam, you know, so you can take a timeless piece like this, this skirt, and fix it up multiple ways. Um, you can go dressy. I can even pair this with a nice um, turtleneck, some heels, or I can wear with a blouse, some heels, some stilettos, and out the door I go. I mean, I can do so many things with this beautiful skirt. I'm so glad that I picked it up, and it was inexpensive. Um, so if you don't know, guys, I am a dumpster diving queen, but I also love thrifting. Okay. So as an FYI, I did get the purse from dumpster diving and I did get that white shirt dumpster diving. So yeah, I mean, I scored pretty well from the thrift store as well as dumpster diving. So let me know down in the comment section, which one did you like best? Did you like one, two, or three? Put it down in the comment section. I love to see and read your thoughts. Teeth are not for biting. Teeth are for smiling. Say cheese. <laughs> Uh-oh, I think that's it. The 
and night night.